Hi there, Anthony Navarro here with Colorado Shooting Sports. We're going to be showcasing one of our new products. These are our new exploding targets. And uh, we're going to be putting it inside uh, one of our zombie exploding head targets and kind of take a look and uh, see how it does. We're going to go you through through the process of how to, how to mix it, prepare it, uh, and uh, set it up uh, for a day of shooting. First off, we're going to go ahead and open up the can. And the can itself is also part of the target. So what we're going to do is you're going to you're going to take a look inside and see one pound of uh, of oxidizer material. Kind of see that there. And then we're going to go ahead and put in the catalyst agent. Uh, wouldn't be a bad idea to wear gloves during this. Uh, this is uh, some pretty interesting stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just dump the contents of this into the can try and shake out as much of it as you can and then we're going to go ahead and shake put the lid on as tight as you can so you don't spill too much of it or anything we're going to go ahead and shake this as much as you can And you're gonna want to, you're gonna want to shake this uh, probably for a minute or two. The more you shake it, the more uh, of the catalyst you get on the oxidizer, and the more uh, effective, the louder the pop is gonna be. So um, I would say about a minute or so would be good. Another thing that I'm gonna do as well is I'm gonna go ahead and take just a, a little bit of this, and I'm actually going to put it inside this plastic bag since there's kind of a, a small amount of the in there that I want to get out. So I'm just going to take a little scoop, a couple actually. And I'm also going to shake the bag as well just to try and get as much of that as we can. Pour this back in. So again, I'm going to shake this off camera for another minute or so, and we'll be right back. All right, we've shaken it for a minute, and uh, what I'm going to do now is kind of explain something uh, that will hopefully get this to get you even uh, more of an explosive effect that you're kind of looking for. What we're going to do is we're going to take this, this uh, plastic piece of uh, material that came with it, and you're going to put it inside the can, and we're going to do what's called tamping. We're actually going to uh, get rid of all this loose space in the can. You can actually see the the dark kind of look like kind of seeds in there. We're going to we're going to pack it down. So what's going to happen is when we tamp it down, it's going to create more pressure. It's going to give the material more time to react and then actually explode. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And you can use like newspaper, you know, whatever you want, but you're going to want to get, get it so that the lid just barely closes. I mean, you really want to get it that tight. All right, it's tamped in with as much uh, paper as I can get going here. One of the other reasons why we want to tamp it down as much as we can is this uh, can only go off if you shoot it and there's uh, <clears throat> enough heat and pressure for it to go off. So because I've tamped it down and half of the can is full, when I shoot it this way, I'm gonna be getting the tightest uh, amount of material that I can. When you tamp, when you go to put the lid on, you wanna get it as tight as you can, but be careful not to deform the can, otherwise it's not gonna seal anymore. So we're gonna go ahead and just do that now. Something else that would help you get even more pressure out of this uh, uh, binary target is to actually then wrap it with duct tape. That'll give you even more pressure buildup before it goes off. So we're actually going to go ahead and put it inside the head now. And we're going to go back to about 100 yards and we're going to shoot them right between the eyes and watch this thing go off. All right, uh, let's blow this thing up. That's why we're here. We want to see this puppy go off and uh, let's light it up.
And there we go. Check out our uh, exploding targets at coloradoshootingsports.com. They're available in the online store or at the shop. And uh, thank you very much. Have a great day. Just want to show a little after action video. Uh, everything that's kind of all jacked up there uh, is from the blast. This was all, it's about eight degrees out. So all this stuff around it was uh, rock hard. Now I'm able to stick, whoa, that's where the target was. I'm actually stick my fingers in there pretty deep. We got uh, little chunks of the can here. So um, we got a pretty big blast radius. Obviously on video, things uh, don't appear as they uh, normally are, but I'm telling you in person, uh, it, it, it shook the whole freaking hill.